Hello, queens, goddesses, mistresses, badass bitches. However you identify, ooh, excuse me, identify yourself with. This is actually the second time I've uh, done this intro. Uh, and subs, hey. Um, yeah, my neighbor does some work on cars. And I think I've mentioned that I need to get about four grand worth of work done to my car. And uh, first and foremost, I just have brake pads. And if I do it at the uh, deal, it's almost close to $500 just for back brake pads. So, um, I know he does brakes and stuff like that. So I just had, I texted him a while ago and I hadn't uh, heard from him and I just saw him outside his house. So I stopped and talked to him. Um, he just has to see if he has a, a certain tool to be able to do my brakes. Uh, he has to look something up. Um, and then I told him about the other stuff that needed to be done and he's like, I actually might be able to do it. And I was like, oh my God. So that would be awesome. That would be awesome. Um, I hope he can do my brakes. God, I hope he can do my brakes. Um, you know, life's expensive. Yeah, just life is expensive. You like it? I'm wearing lipstick. I, 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 you know, I never wear lipstick anymore except for when I talk to you guys because we wear a mask. I'm obsessed. Who's obsessed? The Reese's Pumpkins? Freaking obsessed. I also do the Easter ones, you know, the eggs. It's the perfect, like, ratio chocolate to peanut butter. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. I love these. Anywho, nobody's giving me any questions as to what to chat about tomorrow. Um, I had one comment where, um, it was like, well, maybe you could tell us a story. I'm like, okay. I guess I have a couple. I'm just trying not to get demonetized. <laughs> um, but come on guys. Ask a question. What kind? What do you want me to talk about? Man, it is humid. I'm sweating. Hello, air. Um. So yeah. Um. I don't, I don't know what you guys want me to. Um. I just got booked an appointment. I don't know what you guys want me to talk about. Mm -mm, what you want me to talk about? Now is your time. And I was like, you can even, like, you know, uh, ask me personal stuff. And maybe I'll answer, maybe I won't. So, leave a comment below. Oh, I do have something to talk about. Um, Alright. And you know what? This is not about shaming anybody. I'm not trying to shame anybody because of what type of kink they like. I'm really not. More power to you. Um, this is more about like, listen, if you don't have consent from me to talk about your kink, why the hell are you like leaving me comments or messaging me about what you like to do? Um, I don't care, you know, and there's ways of being able to say, hey, I'm this type of sub and I like to do X, Y, and Z without going into like great detail and stuff. I just am like, and you know, the worst offenders, and maybe I'm just saying this because it is definitely not my jam, are uh, the toilet subs. They're the worst offenders. I'm sorry if some of y'all are toilet subs and uh, 
you're getting all upset that I'm saying this, but I have never gotten any other messages or comments that are just so freaking inappropriate as far as like they sit there and they're like, oh, I would do exactly, I don't care. Are you paying me? No. Um, and I'm just like, Ugh. and like, you know, listen, golden showers, stuff like that. Oh, this, this video just got very demonetized. <laughs> uh, stuff like that. Um, whatever. That doesn't bother me. It's the other, and I, I'm giving you no know, the scat stuff. I'm like, mm -hmm. Do you guys remember, or any of you remember that video that came out years ago, Two Girls, One Cup? I literally could only watch, could only watch like 30 seconds. And then my body, it just, I couldn't. Like if somebody made me sit there and like made me watch it, I would have threw up all over the place. I couldn't do it. My brain hurt too bad from it. Um, my body was like, huh, huh. like I have certain gag reflex on stuff like, and that's just me. I'm not judging. If you're into scat and you like doing it to people and you like having it done to you, more power to you. Not my jam. Not my jam. Um, and it just pisses me off when whether you're a toilet sub or just a sub in general and you come into my my DMs or my comments and you're like I oh, da, 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 da. shut up hey did I give you permission to even talk about what you do or who you are and what you like no so there's that. I, I'm like that with any sub that gets on and tries to make a comment on my videos and you know, whatever. You know, I'm just like, I don't care. I don't care. Um, but it just, I just recognize that more toilet subs just feel the need to share their thing with you know, with me, and, um, and they, and, and some go into great detail, I'm like, I don't care, not my thing, not my thing, and, um, I just think it's extremely disrespectful, extremely disrespectful, and then here's another thing, <laughs> I get it, Subs think that I'm trying to figure out how to word this with like to where yeah I'm just trying to think how to word this to get the point across okay yes I'm superior over you absolutely but when you approach me and you tell me what a low life loser and I, I'm saying this like this is what they're this is how they're approaching me you are are you doing that because you think that's what I want to hear do you really believe that about yourself or what because for me it's the biggest turnoff. I mean, like, okay. I say, like, subs to me, being able to submit and put out what your kink is to people and trust somebody to fulfill that, you, you're not some damn loser. You are a strong individual because people can really you know, exploit that. And here's another thing, like I get it. Some subs are really into humiliation. And I've had subs like that where they just wanted me to humiliate them and everything like that. But when we weren't in the sub zone, this person was not like, you know, 
I don't know. To me, it's like if you're approaching me being like, I'm this loser and I blah, 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 and da, 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 da. And, um, I, you know, I, I, I live like this because I'm a, I'm broke because I give money. You are not the sub for me. Just FYI, you're not. I like my subs to be successful, kind of well-rounded. I am not interested in somebody who takes all their money and blows it on their kink. Ain't smart. I like to have subs that are responsible. And as I've said before, I can't stand doms that sit there and think, oh, I don't care. Send me your rent money, blah, blah, blah. And I'm talking about like, you know, there's ones out there that just don't give two bucks. And you know, they're sociopaths. You're not a dom. You're just a, you're just a freaking money hungry, like, you know, and some people it's, it's really amazing. I've seen some like, you know, I've seen some doms that have been in the game a really long time. And I wonder, I'm like, did you start out like that? Are you just like that sociopath person and this is how you've always been? Or you've become so jaded by everything that you don't give two shits if, uh, you know, a sub's going through a financial time as long as he's just, you know, paying you money? I don't know. Uh, so I just... Yeah, I am, uh, I just, I, if you approach me being like, <gasps> I'm a loser and I blah, blah, blah. What do you want me to say to that? I, I, like, I don't know. What do you want me to say to that? I'm just like, delete. Okay, well, move on because I, my stable of boys, girls, whatever, they are thoroughbreds. They are people who want to expand their horizons and enhance their lives and be successful. I want to help motivate you to be better. But yes, of course I'm more superior than you. Like, uh, you know. And superiority is not gauged by success as far as like financial and stuff like that. I just, you know, as I've said, I'm sure some people are like, well, you don't make the money that so-and-so makes and uh, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, yeah. But you know what? How do you know so-and-so really makes all that money? How many freaking, uh, if you guys haven't subscribed to a channel uh, on YouTube called Inform Overload, I-O. Um, it's Inform Overload or it goes by I-O. I would say do it. They, I found them because they had a, uh, a video about Instagram models and how much these people really do not look like their fucking pictures. Like, it is shocking. And I'm like, yeah, I've talked about it before. It's like the ultimate catfish. <laughs> it's like, wow. Um, you can't, you can't deny, you may not like me, but you can't deny that I'm not up front with your asses. I tell you what's going on. I do videos without makeup, without my hair done. I don't care. I'm like, you take me how I am. That's about being superior. That's about being good with yourself and knowing that nobody can take you down because they got an issue. That is what superiority is. And women in general are just more superior than men. I mean, come on. We are. <laughs> so, yeah. Just, I just... Ugh. So anyways, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Thank you for uh, clarifying with me. <laughs> what the time zones are. 
So yes, I will definitely be on here at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That would be 2 p.m. West Coast Time. And Central Time is at 4? Yeah, 4 p.m.? Yes. Um, and in the UK, is it like 10 o'clock? Or, yeah, 10 p.m.? You guys are five hours ahead, right? I think so. Um, but anyways, yeah, let's chat. I haven't done a live in a while. It should be fun. It should be a good time. Um, but anyhow, I only have, I think I only have one client today. I think. Uh, as I was recording this, I had a pop-up saying that I had somebody else book, but I don't know if it was for today or tomorrow. It might be for tomorrow. I think it's for the guy I know. He usually comes on Saturdays, so that's good. Then I will have a good day tomorrow. Tomorrow I already have a decent day, but that will make it better. But today, yeah, I have one client. And I almost, I wanted so bad to like cancel him and have him come in a different time. But here's the thing. No, Patricia. No. You're, you know, I appreciate my clients that follow me and support me. And this is what's convenient for him. Just because it might not be the most convenient thing for me. Oh, well. Get over it. You know these people support me so I need to help support them oh my god there's an estate sale oh my god estate sales though are very hit and miss I'll tell you sometimes you can find some great stuff and sometimes you're like how much you want for that no but anywho I of course am making my daily run to the post office to send some stuff out I only had two uh, sales yesterday, but hey, if I make, if I can consistently make sales every day, I want, I, I would like it more than, you know, two, um, but hey, that's a heck of a lot better than what I was doing um, a month ago. If I can sell something every day, that's awesome. Anywho, I'm going to sign off. I need to pay attention because I have to turn into the uh, turn into the post office and the traffic around here just blows chunks. But anyways, everybody, I will see you tomorrow live. Log in, hit subscribe, and then hit the bell so it tells you when I upload. And comment about what you want me to talk about. Okay. And subs. Tribute.